Welcome to Rhythm. In this video, I'm going to coach you on how to quickly and effectively record your personal priorities to get started with Rhythm uh, in a new quarter. To do that, you basically want to click on the navigation pop-up here in the toolbar and select Quarterly Planning. Then you want to navigate down the left navigation menu to Individual Priorities. Now we all know that a successful quarter or a winning quarter starts with a winning game plan. And what you want to do with your team each quarter is get into a rhythm of quarterly planning where you meet together to talk about the main thing for the quarter, our top focus for the quarter for the company, our top priorities for the company for the quarter, and then think through your personal accountability, your individual priorities for the quarter to achieve success. And so as we're thinking through your individual priorities, you want to think in terms of what are the top three to five items I must accomplish in the next 90 days? And how are those items aligned with our theme for the quarter? And here on the right side of the screen, you can see that our theme is a new product launch. And success on that theme is that if we achieve $4 million of new product sales. And so John Sales is who we're going to be working with today. And John's going to record his top priorities for the quarter. Now to do this, you simply click the new button at the top of the screen. You want to give your priority a ranking number. So this is John's number one priority for the quarter. And his top priority is to close four contracts. So you give it a priority description. Be as descriptive as possible and be specific and measurable in your description. Then you want to determine what is success on this priority? What is green? Now a helpful tip here is to choose success criteria that's results based rather than activities based. For example, use a specific revenue target or a project outcome from a various activity. What results do you want to achieve? Try to avoid due dates uh, as much as possible because there's already a due date field indicated here on the screen. And so in this case, success for John is the four contracts. Then you want to think through what would be my stretch goal, like making an A-plus on my report card. And that would be considered super green. And in this case, that would be six contracts. Then you want to think through what would be red. Now red it indicates failure. Something bad happens. And so in this case, it would be two contracts for John. Next, we want to understand how this personal priority aligns to achieve a priority for our company or our department. To do that, click on this link button and then simply select the priority from the list that this, that this personal priority is aligned to achieve. And in this case, it's secure the four $100,000 contracts. Now, if for some reason your personal priority is not aligned to any one of these top five, in this case, top three, you would just simply click cancel and not link it. But you should ask yourself the question, why am I doing this? Why am I working and expending energy toward an item that's not aligned with our top five for the company. If it's still important and must get done, then go ahead and just hit cancel and move on. But we're gonna to link to the secure four $100,000 contracts. Next, you wanna ask yourself, which KPIs for the business is this priority working to improve? And so we click this link button. And in this case, John's priority is going to improve the sales revenue goal for the company. And so we'll select sales revenue. The who defaults to the current logged in user. And then you want to select the due date, typically by the end of the quarter in this case. <clears throat> and that's all there is to it. Then you click save. And that records your personal priority. When you go back to the list, you'll see that listed right here in your priorities list. Repeat this process for each of your top three to five priorities for the quarter and ensure that your energy expended for the quarter is aligned to achieve the success of the business.